Hello everybody. So today I will explain you how we do this kind of photographies. They are quite popular on the internet, we see them really often. And in fact, by the way they are really impressive, but they are quite simple to, to realize. The first thing you need is a black background. The second thing I use is a flash. Here I use a studio flash, 800 watt by second flash, a foldable beauty dish, but you can use an octobox, or you can use a transducent umbrella, but you need a big source. I placed it over my object because I want to have some details in the textures. And with this chair, I can bounce a bit of light. Well, the first thing I'm going to do is, on my camera, is to set it at the lowest ISO possible. Why? Because I want to have a really black background without the details. On my camera, the lowest ISO I can obtain is 50 ISO. On some medium format cameras, you can load down at 50, 20 or 12 ISO. For the speed, the highest speed that you can have. Here it is uh, 250 seconds is the maximum I can obtain uh, with a flash. Well, now I will measure the amount of light needed from the flash. So, I use a flash meter. It is an old by a really great flash meter, a Shepherd XE88, really affordable. Okay, then it says me that for 50 ISO I must set my, my camera at f by 5.6. So let's do it. Then let's look what is the result. Exactly the result I wanted to have. You have some details, you have some contrast. It has a 3D look like due to the position of the light. And you really have some textures. Really a great picture. So, as you can see, it's quite simple to do.